Are you interested in binge watching a Chinese drama? If yes, then you should definitely check out our picks for the top 10 best Chinese historical fantasy dramas you must watch in 2023. Starting off our countdown, coming in at number 10 is Story of Cunning Palace. The story of Cunning Palace revolves around a queen named Zhang Suining, who had always aspired to have the highest power and authority in her life. Zhang Suining spent her entire life trying to manipulate her way into a position of power inside the royal court, but she was ultimately confined to her home. During that time, Shi Wei caused total anarchy by massacring the city's entire population. Now she is reincarnated and given a second chance at life. But things take a dark turn when she breaks the rules again. Coming in at number 9 is Destin. <laughs> this fantasy drama revolves around a girl named Liu Yuru, whose only wish is to escape her own family which consists of her ailing mother, abusive stepmother, and neglected father, by finding a nice husband and marrying into a good family. She works extremely hard to become the kind of woman anyone would be proud to call their daughter-in-law or wife. After years of trying, Yu Ru marries the wealthy young master Gu Ju Sai and thinks she has finally made it. Unfortunately for her, Du Ju Sai despises her and believes she is only with him for his money. If you think that fate and destiny play a role in romantic relationships, you will be captivated by this drama. Coming in at number 8 is the Shofu Can Read Minds. So <laughs> this story revolves around a blogger named Shen Ji Hun, who suddenly finds himself transported to ancient China, only to discover that his physical form has been transformed into that of a noble lady. Watching this drama will take you on a mind-bending journey full of mystery and intrigue if you enjoy psychological thrillers. Coming in at number 7 is Right Town. <laughs> This 2023 historical drama is set in the Ming Dynasty, specifically in a place called Ripe where the county was plagued by a string of murders. There was no apparent connection between the victims, yet their bodies were all placed in disturbing formations. The thief also placed messages surrounding all three bodies in writing. If you enjoy dramas with a high level of tension, then you will definitely love this drama. Coming in at number 6 is Till the End of the Moon. This drama takes place in a time when demons rule and humans are reduced to the status of vile cultivators. To find out where the demon lord came from and stop his awakening, the cultivator elders have decided to send someone back in time. Lai Su Su agrees to the assignment, and she marries Tan Tai Jin, the hostage prince and future demon lord. Her mission is made more difficult by the fact that she is a witness to Tan Tai Jin's earlier life and his rise to prominence. Overall, Till the End of the Moon is a really good show that will take you on an emotional roller coaster of love and sacrifice. Coming in at number 5 is The Truth of Immortality. This drama is set on an uninhabited island where Zhou Yu, the first storyteller in human history, and seven unknown listeners find themselves stranded. Clues to Xu's Annihilation Massacre, of which Zhou Yu is the sole survivor, are quickly uncovered. Together, Zhou Yu and Liu Ru Meng, who is posing as his wife, finds clues to an annihilation massacre that happened a long time ago and begins investigating the original murder to determine who is responsible. But with each case they solve, one of them unexpectedly passes away, throwing a wrench into their investigation. Coming in at number 4 is The Emperor's Love. <laughs> The Emperor's Love is a love story focusing on the mysterious and unpredictable god of war of the North Mu Kingdom named Zhan King Cheng and the daughter of the Feng family named Feng King Huan. The rest of the story revolves around their journey as they try to find a way to make their troublesome relationship work. Overall, The Emperor's Love is a really good show and a must-watch for all Chinese drama lovers. Coming in at number 3 is Little Mad Doctor. <laughs> This is a story about a doctor named Chu Jing Han who suddenly finds herself in another world, this time as the princess of the northern Chu kingdom. She faces a number of obstacles, but she is determined to return back home. She finds herself falling in love with the dashing war king, Yu Long Yuan, 
as she learns to navigate this new realm. You must watch this show if you are eager to know whether she will be able to accomplish her goal and find love or not. Coming in at number two is Divine Destiny. This 2023 Wuxia drama is about a piece of bluestone found beside the Tyana River in the fairy world, which is cultivated into an immortal that is mistakenly released as a demon. This monster was conceived in a fairy's womb after it heard the singing of nine celestial books in the immortal world, allowing it to shed its stone form. As the demon passes past a sky demon, he uses the bluestone to transform into a human. Divine Destiny is a low-budget drama about two people who have known one another for 99 lifetimes but will finally spend their 100th together. This drama's touching love story will win over any viewer who enjoys sentimental tales of true love. In the top spot, coming in at number one is Love You Seven Times. Love You Seven Times revolves around the story of two individuals named Shang Yun and Chu Kong who were sent down to the moral world by the Jade Emperor to experience seven lifetimes of love. If you are looking to watch a romantic feel-good fantasy drama, then Love You Seven Times is definitely a must-watch. 